Hello guys and welcome on my channel. Today we'll discuss about uh, stereo preamplifier from Sony TA86E86B. This uh, preamplifier just passed the full restoration like you see already new capacitors are inside here. This blue two minis are burns multi-turn trim pots and this preamplifier it's really really nice. You see the connections on the side. Okay, so I have to take out these short circuit uh, plugs because I just finished the I just finished the um, adjustment of the, of the phono section of the DC offset. If you want to see, you can see you can you can scroll to the previous videos. You know, you will see how I did the uh, DC offset uh, balancing of this preamplifier on phono section. And uh, let's discuss a little bit. So here on the left is the power power supply main section. You see now the the preamplifier is disconnected from the mains. So pay attention if you are opening the cover, you have to pay attention at, what, for what is inside. If you don't know what is it, stop it. If you know what is it, you know already what's going on. So attention. So again, this one is disconnected from the mains. Here is the main power transformer. Here is the voltage selector. It's multi voltage selector, you see. It's uh, 110, 220, here it's 120 and 240. Here in Europe, I should uh, I should select 240. Here is the main fuse, it's 1 amp. Okay, let's go here. Main power transformer, main power supply. So this is the main power supply and the, here is the mute mute uh, stage so this mute stage is his uh, energizing the muting relays which one is here second one is here muting relays of out outlet from preamplifier section so here is the output relay and the timing timing uh, uh, timing uh, process it's uh, it's done by this section here so this one is taking about this kind of, of, of muting. How is doing this? When you energize the power amplifier, these capacitors here, they are charging. In a couple of seconds, you'll have the connections between the output and the preamplifier. When you switch, switch back the amplifier, immediately the, the relays are disconnected. So here is the main power supply with the protection, let's say muting, not protection, muting section. On this power board, what I did, I replaced the big capacitors, these small capacitors. These are the parts which they've been drawn out. Yeah, new parts installed. After that, we'll come here. We'll have the secondary power supply, number one. And for this one, same. I replaced the capacitors. Where it was possible, I replaced the capacitors with film from Vima. Here are the capacitors from this section. Also the transistors, they've been drawn out, clean the old grease, new grease installed. After that will come here on the front and we'll have the secondary power transistor number two. Also for this one, the capacitors, they've been replaced. Old one are here. Yeah, and also for the power transistors, like I said, the grease, it was replaced. Uh, here the distance between the power transistor and the shaft is not any problem because the the power transistors power transistor radiator is fixed really well on the other side so it's not any chance to make contact here even if it's too close it's not any problem and after that here uh, like you see we have two boards separated two boards the board from the right it's uh, designated only for the phono stage Phono stage for the one channel and phono stage for the second channel are totally totally separated, let's say. Okay, also for this, where it was possible, I replaced the, the capacitors, electrolytic capacitors with film, like you see already, and the rest of capacitors also, they've been replaced. And you see this blue, blue adjustment, multi-turn trimmers are from Burns are closed, are sealed, and compared with the previous uh, originals, 
this this they are multi turns that means they have 12 turns you see these originals they are not sealed they are opened and they are prone for oxidation these are the parts which i drawn out from these two sections here and uh, this is how it looks now and on the left we have the power the preamplifier boards circuits not boards because you see it's a complete board with also power supplies so this is the power preamplifier board one preamplifier board two like you see these red capacitors are from vima film capacitors and the capacitors which they've been replaced are here some electrolytics and tantalum and this is how it looks now after this full restoration it sounds really nice the restoration was not so easy because also it's a lot of mechanics here you see all the, these shafts shafts here are fixed with some uh, springs wires you see here i mean the front panel after we remove the shafts here are some washers you, you need to grease that washer so i cleaned also the old grease here on the volume shaft here is the another uh, how to say this support for the shaft from brass also from this one i removed the the grease and new grease to, it was installed but what i like this here is this coupling between the the potentiometer shaft the attenuator shaft and the shaft which is coming from the bottom from from uh, from knob you will see is this connection this shaft connection it's really nice it's first time when i see something like that also it's a spring inside which is keeping connected both of them or all, all three parts but it's really nice how it's turning because it looks like the attenuator and the, sh the attenuator shaft and this shaft they are not properly aligned and they said to <laughs> to choose this kind of system comparing with this one which is directly connected yeah this one here is directly connected and here it's articulated let's see let's say yeah and you will see how is how is you see because they are not properly aligned they use this kind of this kind of uh, coupling it's a plastic there plastic washer it's really really nice really really good like you know already most uh, gears which you see here on my channels they are not uh, from last uh, generations are really really good and well made on that years when when they've been a product yeah on these days you will not find something like that full aluminium front full full uh, knobs aluminium knobs full aluminium shafts full aluminium these uh, shaft couplings really really nice so this is how it looks thank you for your time i hope you enjoy this kind of videos if you don't enjoy it leave on the comments i will try to make other videos if you want if you want to see some other things it's no problem leave for me the comments if you like thumb up and press the like button of course share with others subscribe and stay tuned every second day new video is released and on the next videos you will see also this thing how it's how it sounds on the speakers thank you for your time all the best see you bye bye